great to see guys that you haven't seen in a long time. I've seen guys I haven't seen for over 20 years, some of them. And uh, you know, when you when you play with these guys, uh, <laughs> you you have great memories on and off the field, and it's, it's just great uh, to come back and be able to spend time with them and support your cause. These guys would have fun if it was snowing, <laughs> and you could hear it on the course. Uh, but they're really enjoying themselves. And the one thing that is is important here is that uh, sports is not just about wins or championships. It's about togetherness and shared common experience. There's a lot of brotherhood going on here today. I didn't think. I thought maybe we'd get about 100 guys, and we ended up with 184. Uh, individuals, women included, and um, it just, it, it really touches me. And, and it's not because of me, it's because of ISU. Um, these guys have uh, had got the st their start from ISU and, and they wanted to come back and give back a little bit and kind of and kind of reconnect back to the program, you know. I got a great education at Idaho State and uh, I, uh, I mean people People chuckle about that as I go around the country, but it, totally it's well, totally true. Yeah, I got a great education. Yeah. Second is relationships. Uh, the people that you meet, uh, friends for life, and some, some great people. Well, it takes quite a bit of effort, but it's not all on my shoulders. We have about 13 or 14 um, ex-ISU football players, and of course, we are part of that football alumni team, and. Uh, we started uh, planning this in December, and so we had things online uh, for about three months. But it, it takes a lot of effort to do this. It's tough to pay the bills. I mean, it's, uh, you know, that's why you've got to play money games, and it, it's just tough, and every little bit helps. Uh, I know when I talked to Mr. Nevis, uh, one of the things I just couldn't remember was to buy new football helmets and to help with summer school. Former college coach, I know how, how hard it is to make the ends meet, and we need events like this uh, so Coach Kramer and the staff uh, can do the things they need as they see fit, you know, the things they need to do to, to compete. This is just ex football players and their friends getting together to try and embellish and help football at Idaho State. A lot of the other tournaments that we deal with at other schools I've even been at are generally more athletic department oriented. This one is a specific, specifically for football, and that means a lot to me. I bleed black and orange. Um, I came here from Honolulu, and uh, I went to Boise Junior College, and, I, and then I transferred to Idaho State, and Babe and W, Babe Kasha and W Holt just treated me amazingly and and uh, you know I've been here for 50 years I never went back home and uh, it's very justifiable and I, I need to pay forward and pay back and, and uh, that's my commitment to ISU so uh, uh, and I hope and I know we have other people here because like I said the 13 or 14 other guys that helped us plan uh, they're very committed but not only are they committed, but now we've connected with some of our other brothers, uh, and uh, they're uh, they're wanting to get involved, and, and they're telling us, hey, I've got five or six other guys next year that are going to come back and play and and uh, become active in, in ISU and give back to the programs and help them get their start. A fun day, it's been a really really well-run tournament, and uh, thank you. thanks to Don Nevis and the Fat Club for putting it together.